All right, we're going to take a look at training selection. This started out as a Ninja 3.0, Ninja Forms 3.0, and that's what it still is. So we're going to edit it. I'm actually going to provide you with the types of fields that each one of these are so that this can be easily recreated. I'm going to click the plus sign down at the bottom. You're given several options. This first one for live training, online training, I'm sorry, is the multi-select. You'll click that it'll provide you with the field so we're going to edit that field this is online training we're going to put it as a default a form default we're going to make it as required field this way it has to be populated in order for the form to be submitted you can add additional options here class 1 class 1 85 we put a calculated value in there that's the only way you're going to wind up with a total so be sure and put a calculated value whatever that value is it can all be the same they can all be the difference it doesn't make any difference at all click on display custom class names I didn't put any on this put a description in here select your online training here come back up to the top click done. Now we're going to select one-on-one -on -one coaching which is a select field. That's all you have to do is hit the select button when selecting the type of field to add. Then create a name for it. Form default one more time. I did make this a required field. Now what we want to do with this is we want a value that has a zero sum so I put a no thank you option and that provides a calculated value of zero you have one unit all the way up to ten units each for fifty dollars each display I did put container and elements I don't believe that it's required but I did put them there click on done added a divider as a design element billing instructions calculated total price now let me show you how to get that total price under calculations you go to price total if you look these are the identifiers for each of the two fields that we have. There's a multi-select which is the online training and the select which is a select one-on-one -on -one coaching. Now the way we got these is you click here which is the selection icon for an insert merge tag. Now we're going to take fields, we're going to take online field training and select one on one coaching we're going to select them both and then we're going to put a plus sign in the middle it'll do any mathematical function as long as it's just add subtract multiply and divide click on done come back to the form fields go back down to the billing information which is an HTML field just a simple HTML field now we're gonna pick that calculation because the, we do want a total to go in that amount and you're gonna scroll all the way down to the bottom and happy day happy day price total is here click on that this is a manually inserted dollar sign so that we know that there's a price there that's a dollar amount click on done do not forget to add your submit tag and now we're going to preview this form
as you can see you've got an online training which is required select online training here class one if you remember in the calculated value it was eighty five dollars all three of them were now you can select one two or three then you can come down here and whatever the value is in that calc value is going to be added to the calculated value of the first unit so we're going to click that click that as a submit good to go now it's ready to be filled out again by the same person you can also change that in your setup and that's as simple as it gets now if you look you can go here and view submissions this will provide you with a class one two three and a one unit it does not give you the total field the HTML field but that's it easy peasy have fun with Ninja Forms 3.0. It's a pretty good application to add to your WordPress.